Hello dear colleagues, today we will be performing the excision of the upper eyelid cyst in a 22 year old female patient who presented with the chief complaint of painless swelling on the left upper eyelid. Now we are administering local anesthesia using lignocaine injection. There are no associated symptoms such as redness, discharge or vision changes. The swelling is presumed to be a benign cyst likely an epidermoid or sebaceous cyst. All the preoperative evaluation and investigation have been completed and the procedure is being performed for cosmetics reason. Now we will make an elliptical incision directly over the most prominent part of the swelling. Now we will do some sharp dissection with scalpel to expose the cyst wall. Now we can see that the white capsule of the cyst uh, is exposed. We will apply a pressure with fingers. Now we will do blunt and sharp dissection circumferentially around the cyst. It is stuck inside. During the expression, the cyst unfortunately rupture, releasing its content. This is known as intraoperative possibility, especially with long standing lesions. We are now carefully identifying and excising the remaining cyst wall and capsule to reduce the risk of recurrence. After complete removal, we will thoroughly irrigate the AVT with normal saline to clear any residual debris. We are now proceeding with bone closure. 
the skin edges are being approximated carefully and closure is being performed using 4-0 non-absorbable proline suture. We are aligning the bone along the natural eyelid crease to achieve the best possible cosmetic outcomes. Minimal tension is maintained across the bone to promote optimal healing. Now we will apply a sterile dressing. The patient is advised on routine post-operative care including cold compresses, antibiotic ointments and follow-ups for suture removal after 5 to 7 days.